Roybas. That's how it's pronounced. I had no idea. It is the most amazing tea for pregnancy from first trimester on. And I wanted to share this with you because I love coffee. I am an avid coffee drinker. But when I'm trying to conceive and when, uh, you know, obviously when you're in your first trimester, there's a lot of, of things you're not supposed to drink and caffeine is one of them. Caffeine does cross the placental barrier and it does a number of things that are just not good for the baby and for the baby to start growing. Then you have herbs and there are a number of herbs that are no-no for pregnancy and a lot that are fine for later in pregnancy but not okay for your first trimester. And in doing all my research and having all five of my kids, I wanted to find that drink to replace coffee that I could enjoy um, that was safe. And enter Roy Boss. Let me tell you real quick, um, just a little bit of history on it. It is from South Africa. It is a, a red bush, and that's how it got its name. Roy Boss means red bush and it has been used in Africa for so many years for its health benefits. It is a tea that is full of antioxidants, iron, magnesium, calcium. These are all things that a pregnant mama needs and it doesn't have anything in it that they found that is bad for a pregnancy even in your first trimester. Now I love traditional medicinals pregnancy tea. Um, red raspberry leaf, you know, those are all really great teas but I just don't feel comfortable taking them in my first trimester and there's a lot of people that say the same thing. So I wanted to share with you guys how I make rebas and, and I consider it the most amazing latte for pregnancy and first trimester and I can almost assure you that if you are a coffee drinker and you are giving up coffee or tea for your first trimester and you're bummed about it and you want something to replace it, I really think that this is going to make you happy and be a really good transition um, out of coffee. So what I do is I steep a cup of rooibos and then I put it in my Vitamix. Now if you have any other sort of mixing machine, um, I'm sure that would work fine. Or even just doing it in a um, saucepan with a whisk will work really well too. And I do about half and half or a little bit less milk of your choice. Now I'm vegan so I use almond milk, but I do the rooibos and then about the same amount, if not a little bit less, almond milk. I add in a sweetener, so whatever sweetener you like, whether it's sugar or um, coconut sugar or if you use agave or whatever it is that you like, but I add in that to taste and then just a little bit of cinnamon. Now some people will say cinnamon can cause contractions in your first trimester. Well, that is in large amounts. If you use cinnamon uh, as a flavoring in your food, you're gonna be absolutely fine. So I just put a little bit of cinnamon in there too. And then I either whisk it in a saucepan or I use my Vitamix and I make it kind of frothy on top like a latte and it is just about the most delicious drink I've ever had. Even when I'm not pregnant, I make this more often than I do coffee because it's that good and it's that good for you. Now let me just remind you, Iron, magnesium, antioxidants, calcium. This tea is jammed packed with great stuff for you, whether you're pregnant or not. So I just wanted to pass this along to you. I will put in the description below kind of my recipe for this Roy Boss latte. And I urge you, whether you're pregnant or not, to try it because it is unbelievably delicious. And it's something that you can drink and feel good about drinking because it is helping your body in so many ways. And it is so good. So thank you for watching. Until next time, be well.